A small token of joy is in the works for many children in the foster care system. Chris 6 News reporter Jeremiah Marshall is standing by live at the Texas Department of Family and Protective Services with the latest. Jeremiah. Right, Paulo. I mean, it is creativity at its finest. Let me go ahead and show you what we're talking about here. We have several Easter baskets, goodies, treats, eggs, you name it. It's here and it's for children here at the foster care system. And volunteers here are creating 100 Easter baskets here for these children. And volunteers with the Rainbow Room, a nonprofit group that has helped several children for over the years, say with the ongoing pandemic, the freeze and much more. It feels good to do something positive, especially for children here in foster care. And also to have these children from all ages have a little bit of joy this upcoming Easter. Overall, it's a great experience, not only for the children, but for the workers, because they don't have to worry about going out and trying to find baskets. But for us as a Rainbow Room group, we, um, we enjoy doing it every year. And the group says they have done this for about 20 years and to do their best not to just help the children, but also the caseworkers and workers with Child Protective Services also say these volunteers have always been working hard behind the scenes, especially when it comes to holidays such as Christmas, Valentine's Day, Halloween to even back to school. Reporting here at the Texas Department of Family and Protective Services, Jeremiah Marshall, Chris, 6 News. Guys.